get a free copy of Athium software using the link provided in this video description. When you sign up for an Athium Designer free trial, you will get an Athium 365 and 25% off discount. Hello and welcome to a new lesson. Today we will learn how to design a PCB in Athium Designer. The circuit that we want to build, a temperature sensor with a big microcontroller. So we will start from schematic to a PCB and finally we will get a 3D view like this. So let's get started first we will create a new project so we will go to file new project then we will change the project name to pick 16f 877a then we will select the folder and hit create now we want to add a schematic and pcb to the project so right click then add new to project schematic then bcb then we will save the two files to the same project file right click then save first we will start from schematic this is the circuit that we want to build so we need a pick and the temperature sensor so we will go to manufacture part search then we will get pick 16 f 877a right click then place After that, we want to get the temperature sensor. Then we will get the oscillator crystal. Right click then place then we want a 22 picofarad capacitor and we need two resistors Now we want to connect all the components according to the circuit. If you notice, there is an error, because there is a many component have the same name. To solve that error, you have to go to Tools, Annotation, Annotation Schematic, then we will update the change list, then OK. Now we will accept the changes, then Validate, Execute, then Close. So the error is gone. If you want to know more information about any component in the circuit, you have to go to Octopart website and read the datasheet of that component.
Now we want to convert that schematic circuit to a PCB. So we will go to design, update PCB document, then we will validate, execute, then close. Now we will select all the component and drag it to the workspace. Then we will delete the room and rearrange the component as you like. Now we want to change the port shape, so we will go to view, port planning mode, then we will go to design, edit port shape, then we will change the port shape to fit the component. Now we want to draw the cover tracks, so we will go to route. Auto route, then all, and select route all. Now we want to add a polygon to the circuit. So we will go to tools, polygon board, polygon manager, then we will select board outline and connect the top layer with ground. Then we will remove the dead cover and select bore over all same net object and apply then we will do the same thing with the bottom layer so tools polygon boards polygon manager port outline bottom layer connected to the ground remove the dead cover and apply Okay, now we want to view the 3D model of the part. So we will go to view, 3D layout mode. This is the final shape we got. Hopefully this video will be useful for you. And thank you for listening. This video is brought to you by Antium 365, where the world designs electronics and Octopart the fastest search engine for electronic parts.